Good morning to all of you. Welcome to Legal Matters by Sai Babu Sankara. In law of torts class, particularly in the ME Act compensation cases, I told you some case laws for the last batch. That pillion rider is not a third party on a scooter. He is only a gratuitous passenger. That means unnecessary. by consideration you may be taking him. Pillion rider is not a, a gratuitous passenger. This is uh, what is stated by Honorable, I will tell you the case law. Just one minute. <clears throat> Karnataka High Court. This is stated by Karnataka High Court. Uh, so, by Justice uh, C.M. Joshi. Right, actually, the court was dealing with a miscellaneous first appeal filed by the National Insurance Company against the judgment and award passed by Senior Jewel Judge or Judicial Master First Class. The case law you can read as National Insurance Company Limited versus Sanawullah Khan. Sanawullah Khan and others. This is a neutral citation 2023. <laughs> Right. Coming to the facts of the case, in the year 2011, the deceased Sanawullah Khan's son, he was travelling as a great, he was travelling on the Hero Honda bike of the rider. So the rider was driving the vehicle and this person, Sanawullah Khan's son, he was sitting as a pillion rider on the bank, right? But while so traveling, the rider drove his vehicle in a rash or recklessant manner near Kunigal Big Tank. This is Karnataka, Kunigal Big Tank. Due to the rash or negligent manner, the vehicle fell in a ditch. Fell in a ditch, as a result of which, this person, particularly Sanawala's Khan, son, fell on the right side of the road with a bike and sustained fatal injuries. No doubt, immediately he was shifted to different places like Tumkur Hospital, then he was shifted to Bangalore, kept this incident happened on 24-3-2011 and ultimately after taking, after two days or so, he died. Here he succumbed to the injuries. This is the case. Now, the parents, Sanawullah Khan uh, and others, they filed uh, an uh, ME Act compensation case, right? So, actually, the police registered crime under Section 3.4A, 279, led with 3.4A IPC in crime number 79 by 2011, and they filed the charge sheet. This is one part. Now, we are discussing the compensation. So, Sanawullah Khan and others, they filed... Uh, the so-called uh, for compensation before the MECT, the Motor Vehicles Claims Tribunal, and they demanded 15 lakhs compensation. So here the important point is the driver doesn't have the or the rider doesn't have the valid driving license. So vehicle, no doubt, it's a bike. Here the point is whether this man will get insurance or not. So basically, if you are the National Insurance uh, Advocate, definitely you will plead that since the person does not have any valid license, the person who drove the vehicle, no uh, insurance can be allowed. But the first junior judge, he has asked pay and he has followed the policy of pay and recover. In so many cases, we have discussed Sarla Varma case also. So, pay and recover policy, they have given about 7,27,114. And another point raised by the insurance companies that he is only a gratuitous passenger, unnecessary passenger, just by the uh, kindness this man has given a lift to him. But he is not a third party, right? simply to say. So, insurance applies to TPA, that third party, but he is not a third party. So, no insurance can be given to him. This is the contention of the uh, National Insurance Company. Two points. One is that he doesn't have a valid license. Second point is he is not a 
third party then no insurance can be given to him yes agreed but please remember in view of the facts and circumstances of the case the two since the deceased is a bachelor earning rupees uh, 500 by selling the scrap so the MECT they have awarded 7 lakhs 27,114 and they have confirmed the decision of the MECT right no doubt here the point legal point is the passenger or the person cannot be treated as a third party at the same time here the important point comes the insurance, if it is rupees 100, if it is taken for rupees 100, it applies to only the rider. When they have, they have collected 600 rupees. When it is 600, why? Because uh, the scooter, uh, the two-wheeler driver can accommodate another person also. Another person can travel. Maybe a gratuitous passenger, maybe anybody. So, when you are taking amount for the other persons, that is 600 or 500 is for that person. You have to pay the so-called compensation to him. Very critical point. Normally, insurance company, they say that, number one, a third party not applies to him. Number two, uh, <clears throat> the person doesn't have valid license. In spite of that, the High Court was concentrated to take his condition in a systematic, sympathetic way. And the legal point is, when you collect more money as premium, if it is personal accident policy, only 100 rupees. We have collected to 300 means for the other persons also. This deceased is the other person. You have to pay compensation to him. So this is the verdict of the Karnataka Court CM Joshi. So definitely it will be very, very useful for all of you. Please read the case law and enrich your legal knowledge. With this, I am concluding. Thank you very much.